All right, all right, all right. Hello? Are we there? Yeah, I don't know, the bot's not working. <laughs> it worked good for like two days. Then it broke again. All right, well then. This is fine. Um, well, okay. I guess uh, we are ready though. I'm gonna turn this music down. As I accidentally turn it up. <laughs> it's fine. All right. Hello. Hi, Mysterio. Whoa. If I do that, my camera freaks out because of white. <laughs> it was weird. Hello. Hope everyone's having a wonderful Saturday. Is it Saturday? It is Saturday. Yeah. It's been a busy day. We've been working on a, on a really important video. Sponsored video coming on my YouTube very soon. So that's exciting. And yeah, we're prepping for this. And uh, this will be the first in our series where we play games from my Steam library for like an hour or two. Depending how we feel. I'm going to give myself minimum an hour, one hour if I don't like it by an hour. Or like, you know, we're not having fun with it. I'll stop playing it. Um, if I'm enjoying myself, I'll let myself play longer. But we're going to do at least an hour of every game that we get from this uh, thing. So, yeah, it'll be fun. It'll be fun. Hi! Um, yeah. Um, this will, this, I don't know really what else to say. I guess, uh, hopefully every, all the recording stuff works because, uh, Alpha over there is going to help us edit and turn these into like actual YouTube videos. So that's cool. Um, and yeah, that's the whole thing. Sounds like fun. It is. Hi, Wesley. I hope you'll enjoy it. Cause yeah, it's just something different. I've been playing a lot of story games. I've been playing a lot of story games lately. That's terrifying. And so I was, I thought it'd be nice to kind of take a, a break from that. Um, I'm still going to be doing my Hogwarts Legacy playthrough on my YouTube channel, but it's only going to be uh, in video form, not a live stream. And it won't be edited. It'll be like a live stream, but it won't be a live stream. And uh, so now my live streams for a bit, we're going to go through all the letters of the alphabet in Steam of unplayed games. Only games I've never touched before, and that I have 232 of them. So, <laughs> yes, it's the whole thing. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, let's uh, let's do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, how am I gonna? I have to be all like professional for YouTube, right? Because <laughs> this is gonna be also a YouTube video. We're trying to we're trying to multitask and like make content all over the place. That music? Oh, I'm like, what am I hearing? That is not the right thing. Okay. Anyways. I think I need another camera. Hello. I think I fixed it. I broke it, but I fixed it, but we're good. All right, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the scene had a different sound source. It was weird. Okay, but anyways, what I'm going to say now is kind of introing the series because this is going to be like a YouTube series. So that's why I need a scene without overlays. That's what I was saying this whole time. <laughs> so I have it now. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. 
Um, yes. All right. So what are we doing? What are we doing today? We are doing a new series on this channel where I play Steam games that are unplayed from my Steam library. I have 232 of them. So I have a lot of games, but we're going to select them, not just go through every one. We're going to select them by letter. So today we're starting with A, and then we're going to put all the A games I have onto a wheel. We're going to spin that wheel, and that's going to be the game that we play uh, for at least an hour minimum. If I'm having a lot of fun, I'll play for, you know, two to three hours longer than that. Um, but minimum one hour of, like, first impressions of the game, and then we will go from there. So <laughs> it'll be a fun little adventure. Play some games that are, like, outside my comfort zone that I've just, like, collected over the years from, like, Humble Bundle and just random places. So, yeah, I think this will... This will be fun. Join me on this adventure, I guess. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Now we're here. And this should work. God, I'm so worried about the recording being all like not <laughs> not easy to figure out, but hopefully it'll it'll be okay. So we're going to do We have our wheel. I have all the games from my library that I think is something that we can play. Um, this is like a charades game, and I don't think anyone, like, it's like, you need people to play it, so we're not gonna put that one on there. We have Age of Conan, Unchained. Actually, let me... Just so you can see that they're on there. So, Age of Conan, Unchained. Hold on, what is... Oh, I was like, where is... Hold on. Okay. Age of Conan, Unchained, really old MMO. Uh, Age of Wonders 3, All-Star Fruit Racing, Amnesia, no, we're not doing this one, I, for some reason, I didn't choose it, I, wait, why did I not choose it? Because people said it was bad? Well, that's the whole point, though, no, I wanted to play this one, wait, oh no, this one's on the list, I just added it later, okay, this one is on the list, okay, we're good, we're good, never mind, uh, Amnesia, A Machine for Pigs, I'm not going to put Apex Leg Legends, Apex Legends or Construct. This is a VR game that I played once. It doesn't show I played it, but I have played it once when I had VR years ago. Um, Apex Legends not going to be on there. Arcade Spirits is on the list. Ark is on the list, but I don't know if that's going to... Actually, I can't do Ark because it's a 70 gig download and like... I've played Ark, so I don't know. Oh, that, oh, it's like the, the Battle Royale. Oh, that's why. Okay. Good thing I'm double checking this because I can't play that. I don't think it's like the, the Battle Royale Ark thing. I don't remember. Whatever. Uh, Asterios Curse of the Stars, a game that we found at last PAX West and got to test and looks really cool and I've yet to play it and I wanted to play it. So I was like, you know what? We're going to make sure to get to it. Hopefully. But if we don't get to it today, maybe we'll do like a random, uh, random second chance for the ones that don't get picked. Maybe we'll do that later or like sprinkle that throughout the series. Um, okay. And then Avon Colony, Col Col Avon Colony, which is like a city, a Mars, a space, like city skylines on Mars type thing. Aviary Attorney, which is like a, uh, <laughs> you're a bird attorney, um, and you have to collect evidence and do things and pay attention, so I'm probably gonna be horrible if I get that one, um, and that's it, so I think those are all the games on the list that work, I'm glad I double checked that though, because it, uh, was wrong for one of them, but overall, yeah, that's, that's what we're gonna do, let's, uh, spin the wheel, Full screen that and see ya what we can what we're gonna play today. Alright, ready? Give me something fun, something interesting. How about oh no, oh no, oh no. Age of Wonders 3. Uh, I don't remember which one that was or what that one was about. <laughs> this is the one where I looked at it, I'm like, I don't know what this is. <laughs> uh it's a word winning Strategy game delivering a unique mix of empire building, role playing, and warfare. Uh, Age of Wonders 3 offers the ultimate in turn based fantasy strategy for veterans of the series and new players alike. Came out in 2014. 
going to remove that from the list, all right? And it looks like it's got positive reviews overall, so it may not be completely horrible. Excellent game. Yes, nice. Um, I have over 550 hours in the game. I played, like, everything that you can, uh, and it was totally worth it. Best turn-based strategy game to exist. Waiting for Age of Wonders 4. Oh, so they're working on the next one, probably. Okay, let's, um... Uh, Oh, okay. I was like, wait, is that, is that how much space it is? No, that's how much space I have available. All right, we're good. Gonna install. It shouldn't take very long. We have pretty good internet. So that's good. I guess I should like preload some of the bigger games maybe if I, if they're going to be on the, the wheel just so I don't do it on stream and it takes like you know, 20 minutes to install 20 gigabytes or something. It shouldn't take that long anyway, though. Look at this. It's almost done. It's like four gigabytes in like 30 seconds. So we're good. I think the Age of Conan one was the biggest game that we had. So let me update my titles and all that stuff. And OBS, can you like not break on me? Okay. Um... I'm gonna play, not titles, I just, I'm just gonna, um, I'm not gonna change the name, I'm just gonna up, uh, the age of, age of what? What's it called? <laughs> age of Wonders, not Age of Empires. Is it just like Age of, Age of Empires? I don't, I don't know. All right, so this is our game. I mean, we had some interesting options. This is probably the most tame of all of them. But, you know, we got to start somewhere. It's not something I would choose to play on my own accord. So, all right. Strategy games. I am, I don't know. I'm a little, I'm a little nervous. But hopefully you guys have fun and we have fun uh, <laughs> for, for a little bit of time in this game. Let's load it up. Oh, oh no. Do I have to? Use quest offline account. Oh, thank God. I was like, do I have to make a, a username for this? No, 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 no. I just want to hop in. I don't want to play multiplayer. I just need to play by myself and figure out how to play this game. All right. The audio. That's audio. Hi, game. Remote together? I can play with online multiplayer with people. Okay, it's very loud. Turning it down. Adjusting audio. Okay. And then, how do we <laughs> new? S I know nothing. New campaign. Recommend for new players includes tutorial. Yes. <laughs> um, as Sundren, princess of the renewed high elves, claim your destiny and decide what the future of the world. What are these? Is there community campaigns? Oh, there's just nothing. The community tab is blank. Okay. This game is old. It's not that old. It's 2014. Council of Origins. Story of Sundren. The wheel of ages Voice acted. Set in motion by two opposing powers Shocking. <laughs> the Commonwealth, humanity's greatest empire, spreads. Everything sound good to you guys? Emperor Leonis promises to reward ambition regardless of race, creed, or descent. The empire's machines roll forward. Bring right. wealth to those willing to crush all opposition. The elven court will not submit. It is our duty to protect Athla so that the wonders of our world will never fade. My name is Sundren, and this is my journey. Alrighty, your journey. Let's, um, I don't. I don't know what these all mean. Okay, normal. I'm just gonna hit normal. I'm gonna go easy though. Like, cause I don't know what I'm doing. Unlike the Sims live stream where it's changing audio every minute. I know, they were horrible at monitoring that. That was, that was not great. Yeah, <laughs> it's fine. My father is King Saradas, once first Stormlord of the Dark Elves. My mother is Julia, former queen of the Wood Elves. Their passion reunited dark and light souls, restoring the High Elves. Their this is fully voice acted. I'm like actually shocked. This is great. 
My brother, Prince Thanis, is first born. He is schooled in war and statecraft, destined to great deeds. I was born second, and a girl. All my father wants me to do is secure a powerful husband. But I want none of that. None of that. In public, I may be a dutiful daughter. But I have trained, and I have spied. I will be more than just a princess. In the court, envoys come and go. Yeah, I, don't, I think by the time I move it, it's already going to be out of the way. Elven court, seeking refuge from the human but yeah. Commonwealth with their technologies of metal and smoke. Okay. Play the tutorial. Yes. Warlock, one of the advisors of your father, approaches you with an offer. I have noticed your interest in matters of state, Sundren. It's wise of you to train for possible conflict. The humans are growing ever bolder, and if war should come, the elven court will be stronger for your efforts. If you want to learn more, I can tutor you. Yes, please. I have no idea how to play this game. Sundran of House in Luck. I like her look. She looks nice. Your rise to power begins. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was nice. Okay, um, oh god, oh god, okay. Welcome to Aldor. This legendary isle is pivotal in the history of the elves, but pox-ridden vermin known as goblins are freely defiling its beauty with their blighted diseases, even ransacking the tomb of your grandmother, Elwyn. <gasps> How dare they? You shall have to cleanse this land of their insolent presence. Um, I've given you the Tome of Wonders, a book describing your world in detail. Sometimes I will refer to it. You can click on the blue words to get extra information from the tome. Oh, whoa. That's a lot. Okay. Clothes? <laughs> Let's start with building a storehouse in your village. It will help the village grow in a town fast in the town. It will help the village to grow into a town faster, expanding your domain and giving you more income and production capacity, which you will need for training new armies. Left click on your city to open the city interface. City? So that? Okay. <laughs> yes. Selecting a city opens a city overview. The city, this is going to be so much. <laughs> Why? <laughs> uh, gives you information on the city's current population, size, and income. Resources produced in cities are added to your global resource pool. Gold is used to build city upgrades and units. Mana is used to cast spells, and knowledge is used to research new skills. Production indicates how fast a city can build city upgrades and units. Population growth de to determine determines the time it takes for a city to grow. City production. The tabs to the left of the screen uh, show the units and upgrades a city can produce. Uh, while the queue of things the city is producing is displayed in the center of the screen, the total cost of a unit slash upgrade divided by the hammer of a city determines the number of turns it takes for it to be built. For it to be built? It's supposed to be built? <laughs> I think it's, such a, it's fine. It's, it's, words are hard. I know. Since you already start with a large army, you should concentrate on upgrading your city. City production. Building a storehouse in the city will increase the city's population growth by 100, allowing the city to grow and expand its borders faster. To build a storehouse, select pro produce upgrades from the tabs on the left. Left? What am I saying on the left? It is produce. 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 Not produce. Produce upgrades. <laughs> I was like, those don't look like produce. Okay. No, we're good. We're good. We're good. This, these are producing things. Got it. Which means I need to move my camera again. Sorry, guys. I am going back over here for now. I don't really know. I have no idea what's going to be the best spot for this. But that's okay. Oh, gosh. Okay. Um, produce. Um, builder? Produce. I'm producing a builder. High elf builder. Tier one, high elf, laborer, rank, recruit. Okay, um, sure. Skill to research. Researching skills, this is your skill book. The current page shows the skills that you can research, which includes new spells, upgrades to your empire, and new units you can produce. Knowledge is used to fuel research. It is produced in your cities from 
laboratories and observatories, as well as certain structures in your domain, such as the Vault of Knowledge. Start researching basic seafaring since you're on an island. Probably a good idea, so I can learn how to, you know, get away. How do I explore the island? Okay. Army. You've selected an army. An army is a stack of one up to six units on a single hex and is used to explore the world. Attack your enemies and defend your cities. When an army is selected, you can click on each unit's icon to get more information. So up here. Moving an army. After selecting an army, and, uh, you can order it to move it by right-clicking the hexagon you want it to move to. A preview will highlight the route to be taken. And the section in green showing how far your army is able to move this turn. Move the army to the gold mine in the northeast by right-clicking on it. In the northeast? Click. Okay. Okay. I'm clicking it! Why is it not working? Watchtower. Wait, it says the mine to the northeast. Is this not the northeast? Wait, where's the mine? Temperate. Where's... Eh. It wants me to go to the mine in the northeast. Uh. Am I dumb? <laughs> Can I not figure out where to put things? I don't see a mine. What do you mean? This is gonna be a struggle. So it's very loud. I'm gonna turn down. Um. She. Mine to the northeast. Um. Oh, they're on the mine already. What? No, they're already there. How do I explore it? That's what's confusing. Like what? Oh, this guy. No? I know how to play this game! <sighs> I'm right clicking! I don't... What? <laughs> How do I play this game? I d I'm trying to do what it tells me to do, but it's right to come. I'm I'm right clicking. I'm right clicking. I swear. And it just it doesn't do it. But it says confirm by right clicking. Oh. Maybe, oh, maybe this one needs to go over there? Oh, I figure it out. <laughs> Hi, old swordsman. Sundrin, it's good to see you. We're on our way to welcome you in the city, only to see that goblins have taken over the gold mine. Of course they would. Goblins love their gold. This army is too strong for us. If we attack with both our armies, we can overwhelm them with our superior numbers. One moment, Sundrin. More armies are always good, but armies need to be paid upkeep. Now these soldiers have joined us, our gold income will be lower. Boo. Okay. Very likely victory. Cast spells in auto combat. Uh, sh sure. Highlight attack. Manual combat? There's just so this is one of the worst games to just pick up and play for an hour because like I feel like I need to like play for five hours before I even understand what I'm doing in the first hour. <laughs> this will be fine. I'm trying, okay. Um, um, manual combat? Is that what I want to do? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, skip combat intro. No, we need our combat intro. It's epic. Look at these graphics. Attacking other enemies. It's time for us to begin our attack on the enemy. The defenders always get to act first. We should think- use this moment. We should use this moment to examine our opponents and think up a strategy. Do I... 
<laughs> yeah. I was kind of hoping for like the the one of the dating simulator games or something. Like, got to warm up, and this is just like <laughs> a little bit much. But we got this. That's the point of it. The point of it is for me to get outside my comfort zone. So here I am. <laughs> I may not play this for more than an hour, but we will see. <laughs> um. It's time for us to act, select the units, give them orders. Once all the units have moved, we can end our turn. Every unit has three action points, which are used up by moving and attacking. I got this. Oh, God. Okay, goblin marauders that move the unit over to strike. Do the thing. High elf storm sister, press in. What does that do? Storm sisters are support units. Uh, they have a powerful ranged attack that does shock damage, making them very effective against machines. They also have the stunning touch ability, letting them paralyze dangerous enemy units before they can do too much damage. Oh, lord. Okay, these are... Swordsmen are infantry units. Swordsmen have swords and shields. I would not have guessed. <laughs> okay. Okay, so you can have them move. Okay, so you right click. Okay, okay. I moved a group of and people. I moved them. I'm I'm playing the game. <laughs> this one doesn't go very far. Wait, what am I doing? Oh no, what have I done? I think I messed up. I don't know what I did. Sundrin is your leader. Leaders are one of the strongest units in your army. Blah, 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 blah. During your journey, also encounter heroes who are cool, but not as cool as this guy. It's fine. Whoa. Um. I don't. I don't. I don't know. Um. See, like, I have no idea what any of this means, though. I'm just moving them in a random position. <laughs> like, I don't know what's a good... Like, why... They didn't teach me anything yet. Like, why are they... Why is it orange and green and yellow? Like, I don't know what those mean. I just moved it to a purple. Oh, was that bad? <laughs> Where did I move it to? Where did they go? What did I do? Uh-oh. I think I lost some friends. Oh, well. All right, let's just get everyone near each other. So it's like... Okay, how do I... Cannot reach target. Can you guys reach anything? Cannot reach. No one's gonna be able to reach any of these targets yet. Like... I don't... I don't... I can't move any further, though. All right, that's the closest we can get there. What about you? Can I move you anymore? Or are we, are we good? Oh wait, we can auto combat. No, I have to play myself. I have to play by myself. I have to figure this out. Is this a mobile game? I didn't know. I don't. Uh, oh 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 oh! You can move. Go over there. Okay. Um. 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 Goblin Blight Doctors, Goblin Untouchables. How do... Oh! I did something! They did damage! <laughs> okay! Yay! Um... Right now what? I don't think I have any other thing that's possible to do though. So how do I... End my turn? Turn-based? game <laughs> good luck editing this i'm sorry this is gonna be so horrible um i can't hit them how do i end game i can surrender auto combat cast a spell on this page of our spell we can see our combat spells when your leader casts spells 
In tactical combat, she uses the same casting points she would use for casting global spells on the strategic map. So casting spells in battle may delay spells you cast outside of battle. When you cast a spell with your leader in combat, she'll use up all her action points and will never enter guard and will not enter guard mode, leaving her defenseless. Oh. Um. Well, <sighs> you gotta be kidding me. Right? I don't. Can we hit them? Open spell book. What about this one? Will that do damage to them? I don't think I can. Oh, that's a friendly one. Blind. Can I blind them? 60%, 65, 70%. Is 70, is higher percent better than lower? Shh, I'm gonna say yes. I blinded a bunch of goblins. Easy. <laughs> now what? <laughs> um, can I? Sir. Okay, so I casted my spell. Now, how do I? How do I go to next turn? Because I don't know what else to do. Oh, here you go. You've just ended your turn. Any units who have still... Any units who still have action points left will automatically use the guard ability. Guarding gives a bonus to defense and resistance and extends the unit's threatened zone to hexes behind it. Uh, so it cannot be flanked. Units also replenish their action points at the end of their turn. Okay, yep, yep, yep. I get it. Okay. Progress. All right, they're coming for us. They're moving closer. We are weakened. Weakened five, what does that mean? They're moving forward. Oh, they're all poisoned though. Sunder of House Inok is moving. It, I, I, I don't know if I said that right. I definitely did not. Um, okay, our turn, our turn, our turn. Um, can we, target will retaliate. Okay, what about you? Target will retaliate. Oh no, what does this do? Can we hit them? Range penalty 50%? Can we move closer and then attack? Is that a thing? I don't know, without being like right in front of them? Oh, that's good. Goblin, I, they have 24 out of 30 health, seven to 11 lightning damage times two? Is that, is that what's gonna happen? They did nine and 11. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. That, that makes sense. That does, okay. Um. All right, not bad, not bad. Okay, um, what about you? You wanna hit that? Grab the loot from that or whatever? I don't really know. Ooh. All right, I don't know really what that did, but it, it seemed like something they could help with. Um, here, line of sight penalty, range penalty. Oh, you gotta be closer so you have to eat, so. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We're gonna move closer, and then we're gonna hit him. That's cool. At least it tells you, like, what the negative things that will happen if you attack them. So that's good. Uh, we just gotta get these guys closer. Because they don't have anything. Target will retaliate. Uh, why they do this? I'm trying to understand. <laughs> okay, I can't cast any more spells. I already cast this spell. Anyway, what about you? What happens if I use you guys? Is it too late? Is that it? Oh no, you can do something. You know what? We're just gonna do it anyway. We probably won't die. The unit just retaliated because it's stuck in melee combat. Retaliating uses up the unit's action points, so if it retaliates three times, has no more action points left to act on its own turn. Oop. Get him! Don't! Don't die. <laughs> what if I, like, get her killed in the first combat? No, no, she's good. She's just weakened. She has 32 out of 50 health, so we're good. Yeah, easy. Um... just go closer it's probably not good to be here where we are but you know what i think that's all i can do all right end turn all right we're on our second turn or 
they're on their second turn, and I'll be on my third turn. Oh, they died. No, no, no. Oh, no. All right, we're good. We're good, though. I mean, we got some of them. I think we can take them. I'm not that worried. Um, I think we're going to have you move over here, though. Attack of Opportunity! Oh, no! Hey, this has a lot of stuff like D&D. &D. So maybe this will teach me about D&D, &D too. Right? Because this seems like similar. <laughs> uh, when a unit moves... When a unit moves out of a hex in the enemy's threatened zone, the enemy will get a chance to strike with an attack of opportunity. You'll see if moving through a hex will provoke such an attack by the red triangle on the floor. Oh, I didn't see that. Of course, they tell me after I did it. <laughs> of course. Of course. Hmm. Uh, should we just... I just want to kill them. I just want them to die. All right. They're out of here. So sometimes it's worth taking damage if you can just kill them. It's fine. They're gonna get them. They're gonna get them. Oh, they hit them twice. Three times. Wait, how many times? Three times? Wow, that's cool. I'm just gonna keep keep trying. Oh, I got him killed. I probably should have thought about that a little bit more instead of just clicked. But you know what? Uh, let's get a little closer. If, if I right clicked instead of left click, that would probably help. Okay, now this should kill them, I think. Dang it! You only did six damage! Horrible! Wait, wait. I think I can hit him. I think I can hit him! I'm just gonna run up to him and murder his face. Bye! We did it! We successfully went through combat. It took me like 20 minutes to get through the first um turn. But after that, we, we got it down. <laughs> How's it feel, Sundry? Victory on the field of battle. I can see you have it in you to become a capable leader. These goblins are nothing but filthy, poisonous, poisonous creatures, relying on weakening their enemies and spreading their blighted diseases. We had best rid ourselves of them entirely. Oh boy. We attacked independence and won. Okay. We completed clearing the gold mine. Some wretched goblins taking over gold mine. Blah, blah, blah. No turn limit. Medium. That wasn't even that hard. I mean, it was hard to understand what to do at the beginning, but then I kind of was getting the hang of it. Um. Now, now what's the plan? Explore treasure site adds plus 10 mana when located within your domain. I mean, can we like go to that? Out of move points? No. We can't move. I think we're done. I think I have to... Ready for next turn. I can't move. Wait, what is this one? Cast spell? Can I cast a spell? No, I don't want to... Wait, I have a... Corpse looting? Is that a... That's a spell? Alright, whatever. I sure you have some unfinished to-do events available. No, I don't... Tell me, tell me what to do. <laughs> I don't know what... It says something to do with seafaring. I guess we, we need to figure that out. Why? Why? Currently researching. Okay. Explore the island. I mean... I can't move anymore, though. So how am I supposed to? Show the productions. How much should we produce? Can I just produce one of everything? I don't know if this is good, but I'm gonna produce one of everything until I can't produce anymore. That's smart, right? Okay. Click to end turn. Oh, I did good. You have ended your turn and a new one begins. You can always use the event list at the right side of the screen to see the important events of the turn. Click the events to manage them. Show more information for this event. Skip event space. Go to the next event in the list. Confirm army movement. Go get the mana. How's it work? I stepped on it. Now what? Oh, it's already explored. Rip. Rip. What's here? Dense vegetation. Let's go see what's in the dense vegetation. Wait, what's over here? Combat? <gasps> Berries! 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go get the berries. Haste berries fully restores boots of visiting units. I don't know. I don't remember what all the symbols mean. So I'm just going to call them what the symbol looks like. Adds plus five hammer production when located within your domain. Recharge in three turns. Okay. Temperate. Um. What's over here, I wonder? We're exploring shortcut to Echo's domain. Echo? Sundren, there is a cave entrance here. Be careful inside. Caves reduce the vision range of your units, except for those with the night vision ability. Like Storm Sisters, your high elf units also won't like being underground, so we should avoid battles uh, there if we can help it. Nevertheless, the shortcut provides us with an excellent opportunity to send more units to fight the enemy. Mm. This is probably a bad idea, but we're going in there. How do we go in there, actually? Sure! Oh my god, this is cool, but it's terrifying. What is this stuff? Dense vegetation. There's berries here. I'm going to go grab them. Okay. And then what are these? Just vegetation? Like, is there anything in this vegetation? Like, or is it just like... I don't... I don't know what I'm looking at or for. Let's just go... Oh god. Let's go over here, see what see what gets explored. Not much, okay. Uh, I guess I'm going over here. I'm out of moves. I'm out of moves. Oh no. This is fine. Caves and underground. Um, has a different terrain type disliked by high elves. Hmm, okay, I need that, obviously, but that's, I mean, I'm already there. Oh, do we want, so this army, do I want them to come with me? Or do we want them to go here? Maybe explore over here. Let's see what's at this watchtower, maybe. We're lagged. There are enemy. We will When will they ever learn to live in harmony with what they have instead of greedily wanting more? I guess their short lives make it impossible for them to see the consequences of their actions. They do not need to sustain their surroundings. This is why you need to take responsibility, Sundren. Your family has long ruled the world and should do so again. Uh, structure was undefended. You capture a watchtower. Heck yeah. I know what I'm doing. A stash of mana. I'm gonna go get that. What? Casting spells. Mana is crystallized magical energy. When you cast spells, you consume mana and casting points. Your cities... So these up here... Um, your cities can generate mana if you build their corresponding city upgrades, such as shrines and temples. I advise you to summon Grimbeak Crows to scout ahead. Click on the spell casting button to the left of the mini map to open your spell book and choose the summon Grimbeak Crows. You have found 92 mana. Uh, spell book, summon Grimbeak Crows. Uh, preparing spell. Oh. Interesting. So it doesn't get played right away. You have to wait till one turn. Interesting. Well, the only way I can go is one spot this way. So I would like to go over there at some point, but that's not going to happen. So we're going to wait one turn. I don't know if that was what I meant to do. Never mind. Um, uh, um, Hello, Jacob. I know, I'm trying to get back to the... Okay, there it is. Okay. But they're done. Like, I can't do anything, so I think I have to end turn? A new day begins! Or, a new day dawns! The village of Farsal... Falsurial produced high elf builder. Nice. Um, summon Grubig Pros is ready to cast. Okay. Okay, summon Grim Beat Crows. Wait, what does it do even? Um, uh, melee attack? Six? Okay. <sighs> Can I? Where am I supposed to use them? I don't know what I'm supposed to use them on. Hold on, let me see where she what she can do. I'm curious here. Sign, get your elven, get your elven bones here. Half the gold, double the fun. Uh, yeah? 
I'm coming. What do I get? What do I get for being here? It's just a sign? Oh, I thought it was something cool. Where does this go? Cave exit. Underground layers. Okay, but where do I want to go through here? I mean, I guess? Sundar, be careful. You're now nearing your enemy's throne city. Make sure you have a strong army at disposal before you attack. Oh, yeah. Strong army. <laughs> um, about that. I just started playing the game. The island is covered in blight. Terrain high elf units dislike. Um, you should be careful here since the morale of your army will be lowered, reducing your effectiveness in battle. Great. Great. Well, I can't move anymore here, so... I would like to go back. I would like to go back. Oh, 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 whoa. I found the map. This is very, very D&D-esque. All right. How do we, where do we, what do we, <laughs> I, th I think I just want to keep going, like exploring and seeing, ooh, what's this? A settlement of the local elves of Aldor who have asked us for help with the goblin infestation. They should be honored that one of Inyox, uh heirs graces them with a visit. Independent towns will often offer friendship and quests, but some may be hostile. Let's see what they have to say. Alrighty. Let's go get this. Mana node. Oh wait, we have to fight some wisps apparently. Alright, let's do it. Combat. Independents are moving. Oh my god. How do we... <laughs> um... So those are the wisps, same? Eh? Alright, well first turn. We are gonna move closer, I guess. Is that all the people I have? <laughs> Wait, where's my girl? Oh, I don't have that one here. I just have these two. This might be a problem. How much health do they have? Oh, they don't have a lot of health, but they probably hurt. All right, I, I think we can, I don't know, give them a buff, a seeker buff, whatever that means. Yeah. Okay, I think I'm good. Let's see what the next turn has for us. Please don't kill my friends. <laughs> Come on. Oh, they're getting they're getting a little beat, but they're just wisps. We should be able to take them down. Physical shock protection. Oh geez. Okay, hold on. What about you? Is any uh, like how do we hit them? Target will retaliate. Times three? How am I supposed to hit them then? Is, uh, um, they're just gonna die. <laughs> Shock protection. I mean, I guess I'm just gonna see what happens if I hit try to hit them. Cause like I have to hit them. Ranks of promotion. A unit just leveled up and got promoted, which gives it better stats and ability bonuses. Units earn experience by using abilities, killing units, and being struck in melee combat. You can see a unit's rank, how much experience they have, uh, by mousing over the metal icon in the unit panel. Well, I mean, we killed them. I think we can take them. I'm not too scared of no wisp. Oh, there. It's like it's like little like fairies. Okay, or sprites, I guess maybe. Okay, I don't think I can. I don't know. Blinking. Can I cast another spell? No. All right, end turn. Next. Please don't 
The unit has been flanked! It has been attacked from a hex outside its threatened zone. When a unit is flanked, it takes more damage and loses the ability to retaliate as it turns to face its attacker. Flank is a vital part of combat, allows you to maximize damage while minimizing damage you take. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not looking good, guys. Not looking great. <laughs> um, we only have 16 health. Can we... Uh, they're gonna hit me six, four to six times times two. I can do, we only have 16 health. They have 18 health. We're not gonna hit them strong enough. A for awesome Anna, yeah. Awesome everyone. Hi, Lighthawk, how are you? Um... I'm just gonna see what happens if I hit them. Oh, they're gonna so die. I'm so dead. I'm gonna fail. This is it. This is the end of <laughs> end of the game. It's over. What have I done? Oh no. Oh no. They healed to full. What is that? No. Game over. I lost. Oh no. I'm not strong. I don't know what I'm. I got. I killed one of them. And then I didn't know how to, like, actually fight him right without him. Oh, that's disappointing. Well, I can't do anything else right now, so. Treasure raiding. Corpse looting. Treasure. Seek inspiration. Oh. Treasure raiding. I don't know what that does, but we're gonna... Uh, and terrain? Different races like different types of terrain. Da, da, da. Yeah, I know that. You meet the friendly outpost of Lyrian. Prepare to be destroyed. Oh, what is this? The outpost of Lyrian. We have an urgent matter to discuss. This is so hard to read. It could improve the relations between our people. Wisps are feeding on our mana node, blocking our income. We could have attacked them ourselves, but we fear their stuns and teleports. They are also healed by the mana currents, an active combat effect. An active combat effect. I don't know why reading that was so hard. You can see whether a structure has a combat effect on the moment you attack. Uh, the effects icon will be shown under a portrait. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna go here, I guess, to clear a mana node. But I couldn't kill them, Wiz. They were hard. You're now at peace with the outpost of Lyrian. Okay. Let me know when you are ready to talk. Um. Yeah, so that's the problem. I have to, I have to go, I have to get her all the way back to the mana node. Army requires your orders. My orders? Cost half as much as normal? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, that's fine. I just waste stuff. Okay. I need more fr more people. I need more units. I need... Oh god, how do I... Uh, can I build any of this stuff yet? No. Plunder! Okay. Uh, end turn? No, I don't... I know an army requires my orders. Wait, how do I... Why is it requiring my orders? What does that mean? An army requires your orders. I don't. Oh! Do. Oh my god, this is so much. <laughs> this is hard. Okay. Um. An army requires your orders. How? What, what does that mean, exactly? Um... What's this? Wait, wait, wait. This unit has the ability to be used on the world map. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I clicked it. Okay. I clicked the thing. It says build a fortress. 
Constructs a fortress on the target hex. Fortresses that expand the player's domain but do not house any population. Possess no production capabilities. Watchtower. Vision. Road. Fortress. Wait, constructs a fortress? What's the difference between this one and this one? It's already a structure on this hex. Oh, there's already a road here. What? I'm so confused. What am I even looking at? <laughs> How? Army requires your orders. Okay, yes, I know, but like... What about here? I guess I can put something? Can I put... It's already a structure on this hex. I know. Valid location. Okay, I can put... Let's do a watchtower, maybe? Over here on the edge of our domain. Okay, okay. Oh, I did it. <laughs> They're making a watchtower. Progress. Uh, is that it? Oh, wait, no, we're not done yet. How? Completing one turn. Anyone else need a... Wait, oh, I forget. I can rotate it. Oh, God, it's like opposite rota rotating. Oh, Jesus, that's confusing. What about here? This is a gold mine. I don't... I killed those other people, right? So, like, nothing can be done about that. An army requires your orders. This, you? What does this mean? <sighs> Click to move a unit. Uh, select an army. But I can't move it. I can go back in the cave? No, I can't. I can only leave the cave and go back in. Like, what? Enter. I can't move, though. It says I can do stuff, but I can't. What does this mean? Click to move the unit in and out of the selected army. Can I just move her separately? Ah, dang it. Okay, okay, I got her moving. Oh, we trespassed. Uh oh, Echo's mad. Elves, you're trespassing in my domain. Get your tight little behinds off of our island. We bought it fair and square and will not tolerate any point-eared point pretty faces like yours. Aldor is goblin land now and it will become a soggy, a big soggy blighted swamp filled with elven bones and rotting trees. Nice. Ha! This is hardly, this hardly comes as a surprise. Someone tricked them into coming here. Commonwealth humans, no doubt. They want every scrap of elven land. Our proud legacy and our memories mean nothing to them. I'm afraid we cannot reason with the humans. We've been trying for so long to make them honor their treaties with us, but they are untrustworthy to the core, just like goblins. No, it was you, pretty face, pointy ears yourselves. Oh. Sundran, we cannot reason with cowardly liars. It leads uh, to doubt and division where we should stand united. No high elf would have ever allowed this vermin to soil Aldor. I've already spent some tribute. I've already sent some trebuchets to shatter his city walls. Use them to capture the city. Oh God, I am not gonna. No, I'm gonna fail this so hard. Ready to see me completely lose the tutorial because I I have this girl like just get murdered <laughs> the first round. No, what else could I do? This army still wants wants orders, but like honestly. They're not, just wait one turn. Okay, that'll be, that'll be your thing. All right. Whatever, I don't care. Next, next, next turn. A new day dawns. Okay, what does it mean though? A skill to research, advanced seafaring, trial running, off the beaten path, bless, bless is a unit. Can they heal? I think we should probably get some healing because I feel like I need to figure out how to, uh, you know, keep my people alive so we're gonna do that i guess we're gonna fight this thing or what magma forge explored treasure site not producing income this turn okay do i need to go here is this what they they're wanting me to do okay Okay. Progress. This is gonna be so bad. Very likely defeat. Abort! Abort! No, I didn't mean to move it! God dang it. How do I get-
get more people here to fight because ah what have i done no leave why are you here i can't move dang it I'm just... Army requires your orders. Oh, this one? No, we're not gonna be able to fight with... How do we... <sighs> I don't know! How... How do I get better, stronger armies? Mm. Event history, map settings, menu. Gonna move here? We're just gonna go grab everything, I guess. Because if we fight, we're gonna lose. But if we just loot, that's fine. What about this guy? Shrine to the Guardian Angel. Very likely defeat. Oh, no, I don't want to go there. I'm gonna go get some berries, I guess. <laughs> what is this orb? What is this statue? Oh. Column of champions. Add the level or promotion to the army. Oh! Well, that's cool. You have found 46. Whatever those are. Casting points. I knew that. Um, how many- you have so many moves, dude. I can't- oh, I can't mind that. Wasn't I- was I supposed to go and fight? Cause like... I don't think I did that right. <laughs> how do I- how do I combine them back into the army? Like, can I just- I can't click and drag them? anyway like like how do they diplomacy oh god on right side you see a race happiness and race governance echo the uh, explosive so he's our friend no he's not oh we can negotiate we're not gonna declare war let's negotiate wait i have a peace treaty you have a peace treaty how come we just offer a peace treaty to each other and then be happy send proposal does he not like that let's see what he thinks your death will be our pleasure no i was trying to be nice look what they did they're gonna get all mad at me army who needs my orders you need my orders Okay, let's get you closer to over there, I guess. I don't know how else to get over there. No! I gotta click. Alright, that way. End turn. <laughs> it's not going great. Village of Falserial produced high elf long boat... Long bowmen, not boatmen. Okay... How do I, how do I edit the army? Like, I feel like there's a, s right? Just gonna keep building stuff. Um, I gotta figure out. God, it's so, it's <laughs> tedious. It's a tedious game, I'd say. Enter, take this across how do i come back? does anyone know how to play this game anyone in chat ever played this game or this type of game i played a couple games similar but like uh, it's a lot all right how do i leave enter enter the exit got it what is this you can build a, a fortress or a watchtower? What? Water fortress, a road?
I cannot build in someone else's thing. Yeah. Mm. Can I build a fortress like right here? Would they get mad? You can't move there. Oh. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> okay, next. Oh, you just combine them by, okay, 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 okay. I figured that out. Combine this with this. Okay, okay, we got three of them now. That's, okay. I think I figured it out now. Somewhat. <laughs> now... Ooh. Oh, I have one guy here. I guess I gotta get them as close as I can. I can't move. Oh, you! You wanna come out here and join them. Okay. We have people. We have, we have a team again where we're not all separate. I accidentally separated and didn't know how to combine them. But uh, okay, progress is progress. Now can we fight them? Oh no, we don't have move points. Dang it. All right, well, we have another thing here. What do you mean? Click to enter. No, that's all I can do. Echo has declined your proposal for peace. Ha! You're a fool to even suggest this. Whatever. I mean, I just thought it would be nice. He didn't like my treaty. What a jerk. Right, I guess we gotta try to get more of you guys over here. If that is how this works. I can't move that far, so... They're just gonna go as far as they can towards this direction. Yes, yes, yes. And then confirm. I guess we can try to fight it. Okay, we're gonna do that. Confirm, go get some gold from that. Oh, we can't quite fight. Oh, I'm out of move points. Oh no, okay. Um, select a skill to research, okay. Hello, Chan, you're late. Hey, welcome in. Well, don't worry, we're gonna be turning this also into a shorter edited video. Still be kinda long, but shorter than the stream. So if you wanna see me struggling through the beginning of the game. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. It's very like D&D-esque. And I need to learn more about D&D, so maybe this is a good one for me to to actually play. <laughs> but yeah, we're, we're checking it out. I haven't played a lot of strategy games. I don't even know. I don't. I don't tend to lean towards them, because a lot of thinking. Sometimes when I when I game, I don't want to think that hard. So, but this this is actually the more I'm playing, the more I'm like, okay, I get it. I get it. <laughs> Even though I don't really get it, and I've probably made like 50 mistakes up to this point that people are like, oh my god, how dare you? Like, I don't know. <laughs> okay, um, scoundrel. What about dispelling is probably a good idea. Let's ha let's get this spell. Um, the village produced this guy. What did I change? Oh, I want to, I don't know, I'm just gonna... Build more things. If I click the right buttons. There you go. Okay, okay. Then here. How do I click on you? No, I want to click on the... Okay, okay. We got it. We got it. We're moving. There you go. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm somewhat making this work. Confirm the movement. Now, I should be able to fight them. Do we think we can do it? 
Dang it, I keep clicking right clicking or left clicking. Probable defeat. That's better than most likely defeat. That's progress. <laughs> the morale is low. Oh lord, okay. Oh god, what if I just randomly do really good? Then we gotta try. Sundren of House Indiog attacked Echo. The explosive. Hum. Interesting. Siege battles. You're now engaged in a siege battle. A city has a wooden wall which provides defense against range attacks and keeps enemy units out. Units that stand on the walls gain a plus two range bonus on their range attacks. Walls can be climbed by units with wall climbing or destroyed by units with wall crushing. <laughs> the gates can be destroyed by the melee attack of any unit. Oh, okay. Interesting. So these are my people. Okay, I don't... <laughs> this unit is a war machine. It takes less damage from range attacks but cannot regenerate health. Trebuchets launch boulders to knock down walls and outrange normal range attacks. Uh, cannot move and attack in the same turn. Okay. Oh. Let's hit that thing with the trebuchet, I guess. Whatever that is. A hurling a boulder for 53 damage. That's pretty good. Um, and you, I'm just gonna get you a little bit closer because, like, we can't do anything right now. Yeah, we'll just get closer. Kind of be a little spread out, maybe. You can go over here. Trebuchet, you're gonna chill there. I'll probably put you over here so you're kind of hidden behind stuff because since I know line of sight is a thing, that's a... Uh... Yeah, let's, uh, let's do this. And then... Oh, you guys still get to go? What do you mean? Oh, there's more over here. Okay, there's way more than I thought, even. I guess you can move more. Alright, let's back you up. We'll put you guys here. Oh, you still have more freaking steps. You crazy. Place a unit in a defensive stance. Hmm. You should get a coin flip for the next time it's 50-50 chance. Oh, yeah. Good idea. I love the random. Obviously, that's why I'm doing the random Steam game thing in general. So, I like that. Good idea. I do have, I have D&D &D dice too. I could use for stuff like that. That's okay. I understand. I understood what you meant, I think. <laughs> yeah. Like, all right, we're not going to decide. We're going to let fate decide the chance. Yeah. Okay. Um, let me just see if, oh, you can move again. How about we go here? Melee strike 27. Interesting. Place a unit of defensive raising. Can't be flanked to have a heightened awareness. I guess it's not a bad thing to do that. And here. Stunning torch. No, we can't do any of that. I guess just bulk up, get defensive right now. Like, are those all our people? We don't have that many. <sighs> Alright, we got this. We're gonna kill Echo the Explosive and his army. Or his army. Is he even there? Yeah, I think so. Oh, he's up there. Oh, he would. You better not poison everyone. No, those hurt. Stop it. Ah. Uh, no, stop. How many times do you get to hit? What? A wow. That's not fair. All right. Trebuchet time. Oh, we can't. We're not close enough. Trebuchet, can you move? You need to get closer so you can actually hit the wall, I think. Yeah. Yeah, we have to. Otherwise, there's no point. Okay. High elf builder. I guess I want to get closer. Can we, like, do anything to that? No. Ugh. Probably a bad idea to be right up close. But you know what? I don't. I don't know better, so <laughs> let's get closer. <laughs> it's fine. Purple. 
Is purple good? I don't think I can actually go there. But it's purple. Why is it purple? Can I get, like, right up on the wall and then... <gasps> oh, that was cool. I made, like, a little ladder. I was not expecting that. Okay, bye, Mysterio. Thanks for hanging out. We won't be going too long, so... But, uh, yeah, look forward to the next one. This was A next time. Actually, we're gonna do a spin at the end of the stream for what letter we're gonna do next. We're not gonna go exactly in alphabetical order. So that'll be... I'll at least know what games we're gonna choose from before the next stream. That'll be good. Uh, how about... But I hope you have a good night. How do we move... Okay, we move over here. I feel like hiding over here might be a good idea. Hide behind these pots. Yeah, 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 yeah. Target cannot be affected. Yeah. I don't know how this works. All right. Oh, I think maybe if I go like right there, it'll be okay. What about you? Any of you do anything else? Okay. Oh, the camera angles are opposite what I do for The Sims. Oh God, oh God, oh God, it's fine. How do we reach them? Dang it. What is this? Cast a spell. Okay, how about rain? Wait, what about... Let's blind them. I think that would be a good idea. Make it so they can't hit us. Probably. Okay. Alright, so we did that. You've all done your things. Who, who else? Oh, I didn't see you over here. You can still go, eh? Can I hit you? I can't reach you. Can I hit you? I can. Line of sight penalty. Ugh. Can we move first? Hold up. I can't move again, but we can cast a spell. At least it's something we can do a little bit of damage to him. Three to four. Oh my god, we're all we're gonna die. Alright, we're gonna just hit him. Just hit him. It's fine. Did it? I have to hit the right <laughs> right button on the mouse for it to work. Alright. We did five damage. That's something. Um, who else? Oh, you can still do something again? Okay. Lightning. Line of sight penalty. Range penalty. Okay, this is flanking though, but line of sight penalty. So, let's see what happens. Flanking! We did eight damage. Woohoo! <laughs> that's something. That's something. Okay, end turn. I think everyone went... Oh god, okay, we're all gonna die, aren't we? This is not gonna end well. Weekend 5. Melee strike. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Alright, it's fine. It's fine. Fumbled. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, they killed this one over here. Oh no. Well, they're not all dead. There's... Still a chance. Can we go? Cannot reach target. Can we charge through the wall? Wait, you know what? That's not a bad idea. Go charge through the wall so you can get to them at least. Yes! Fumbled. Did we fumble it? We didn't even do it right. Oh, oh well, we tried. Can we hit him? We can hit him, guys! Plus one range strength, line of sight penalty. Okay, is any of these ones in a better line of sight? No. And in range. Nope, I guess we're gonna hit you. Let's just do it. Come on, trebuchet! Do our damage! Okay. Now what? Oh, you can do something. Can't hit them. Cannot reach them. I think we can do that one. That's the only thing I think is useful right now. So we'll just have you attack them. They're taking damage though. Look at that. See that little tiny thing about flag above their head? That's their health, I think. Okay, what about you? You seem useful. Let's let's buff up defense. Alright, is everyone 
Everyone's still alive. Yep, I can't do anything else. That's it. Oh, please. Please don't kill her. Oh, no. What's happening? 15. Your leader died. Oh, no. When your leader is defeated in battle, but still uh, has their throne city, they will escape into the void. While your leader is in the void, research is halted and you cannot use spells with your leader. They'll return to the throne city after three turns. Rip. Well, then, I think um, this game is going to be over real quick. This will probably be where I end it after I fail this. I thought maybe I could take them, but uh, they're just... I just gotta get good, you know? It's tough. That hurt. I know. Like, really? I thought that I could charge through and do some damage, but it was probably a mistake to send my leader at the beginning, but... Uh... Oh well. Trebuchet. Wow. I can't do anything. I mean, I can move closer, but like... I can't hit them. Yeah, there's nothing I can do. I can hit these guys. They have plus one range... Wait, if I go back one... Would I have higher range strength? Not yet, okay. I just don't want to completely screw up or whatever. We're just going to hit him. Go, Trebuchet! Do your work! Ooh, 11 damage! Hey, that's something! We only have two things alive, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> oh, dang it. This might be a problem. <laughs> little, little tiny problem. Yeah. No. Stop poison. Oh my god, they did. It's like poison, poison, poison. Giant poison damage. Rip. No, no, don't touch my trebuchet. Trebuchet will win it for us all. <laughs> 13. Uh, <laughs> 13 to 19. They only. They have so much health. I guess I could hit the wall. It's not really gonna do much. Oh, wait, I might- Okay, I'm gonna still go for these ones because they're actually low. Do some damage! Oh, he didn't kill it! Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, it's looking bad when all you got left is one trebuchet. <laughs> it should be enough to do damage, but I don't think so. Oh, boy. Fire musket flanking reinforced. Leave me alone! Stop it. Stop it. 32 damage! Oh, it's over. It is over. Oh, these poison ones in the back are annoying too. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. No! I'm dead. <laughs> I couldn't do it. I attacked Echo City of Gorg and I lost. I think it's safe to say I don't know what I'm doing in turn-based strategy games like this, so... <laughs> now what? Is the game over? No. We'll return in three turns or something, but like, I don't... I can still move? I can still do other stuff? I have like one... I have one character left. <laughs> like everything else is dead. How is this gonna work? Enter. Okay. Um. Send you over here. To your death. End turn. They fled to the void. I know! A new day has begun. And I have one- yeah, I literally only have this one thing I can- I can tell what to do, because everything else is dead. Oh, she still wants to go? Alright, well, you can go run around, I guess, but it's not really gonna be that useful. What? Oh, there's one more. There's one more. Don't worry, we have two people now. No, I think, I think, <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna, I just want to get my leader back alive. I think that would be good. I don't think I'm really gonna make much more progress. <laughs> Uh, that's okay. That's the 
point of doing this type of stuff is uh, try different games that are outside my comfort zone and see if maybe they surprise me. I will say this, it's interesting. I just need more time with it. I need to play it for a few hours on my own and actually read stuff and like actually understand it, but I kind of think it's interesting. It's pretty slick. Like they, it's a little confusing, but it's still like not as bad as I thought it might be. <laughs> Cause I was like, I don't know this game at all. Oh. I guess that's all, uh, all I can do. I'm waiting for my for my girl to come back. Hello, Carol. Army requires your orders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They want to do something. Go get some gold for me at least, okay? Thank you. I can't move. Why aren't they moving? Click, move. There we go. Go get some mana. Can I just, like, leave? <laughs> Can I fight this? Very likely defeat. No, no, no. Probably not gonna do that then. Let's just walk this way. Try Dying Light? I, I do have it. I've played Dying Light too. It's on my- I've already played it though, so... For this series that I'm doing, I'm, I'm playing games I have never played before, so... Owen's tomb is close. I remember her grandmother's radiant smile and boundless generosity well. She did not deserve her fate. Murdered right here on this isle. The goblins got their hands dirty, but they were just pawns. The real culprits were the humans. They splintered the harmonious peace when they invaded the Valley of Wonders and slew your grandfather, Inioc, ruler of all creation. Their greed uh, led the world down its path, and we elves still suffer for it. Uh-oh. Okay, okay. This is fine. Was a sign. Haha, <laughs> so easily these bright green leaves turned to sweet-smelling rot. <laughs> okay. What is this? Can I move there? I don't have enough points. Never mind. Army requires your orders. Who? You? Oh, you want to go meet up too? Okay, you go get some mana. And we gotta get our we gotta get our lady back. She's dead for now, but she'll come back alive before we know it. I played original Dying Light, yeah, and Dying Light Two. I haven't beat Dying Light Two, but. I played more of Dying Light 1, honestly. Now who else? You want some orders? Okay. Go through the cave. Da da da. This way. And that's all I can do. Oh, we produced a battering ram. That's good. Okay, we have more. She's alive! All right, we're live now. Um, I think we're probably just gonna call it here because I don't, I don't know. I think, well, shoot. Uh, no, I can't because look, it said, what What happens when I go here? Let me just go to this real quick before we're fully done done. The Tomb of Elwyn, there it is, defiled and ransacked by those foul goblins. They have no right to trespass on this hallowed ground. They are still inside. It sounds like they are boiling soup from their bones. Laughing and feasting, kill them all. Move your army to the tomb and enter it. Explore the island! Okay, so we completed that. Aldor, this island belongs to the Elven Court. Goblins are desecrating its pristine nature and de despoiling the tomb of Elwyn, once queen of all elves. We should explore the island and see what happened to Elwyn's tomb for ourselves. To do this, we can capture watchtowers or send units to scout. Okay, dokie. I guess, uh, I wish... Is there a way to, like... <laughs> like, see how far she goes? Is that as far as she's gonna go? Why can't you walk very far, girl? What happened? Cleared the tomb. Constant gnawing on the sacred bones of your ancestors by these goblins has to stop. Go to the tomb and enter it to end the miserable lives of these filthy creatures. Shrines are sites that give visiting units a bonus for their next fight. Once used, they'll need a few turns to recharge before they can offer their blessing again. Okay gonna put you with you we gotta build up our army again <laughs> before we go to this battle which is not actually gonna happen probably but at least we're gonna give it a little more of a chance oh 
Why? Oh, you're- I was like, who? Who needs my orders? You're underground. I didn't even know you were alive. Alright. Okay, we got that. Mm, and they can't go anywhere else. So, ending turn. Uh, now... I think I need to get... No, I didn't want to... Oh, I accidentally clicked the wrong way and now they're went backwards. Oh, well, that means I can combine you guys real quick. That's a good thing. Uh, except we can't move now, so... What about you? Can you move? There we go. End turn! Going there, going across the path. Oh, I can go all the way through. Let's go! On the road. Beautiful. Um, that's about it. I can go one more square. Um, yep, that's it. End turn. New day dawns. Alright. I don't think I'm strong enough yet, though, but we'll combine. Because now it's one, two, three, four, five. I should get, like, one more thing, maybe. Alright, I should... Okay. Okay, so we have another one. We're gonna get this one. We can do another skill. That's good. Holy cure. Should probably do that one. Um, I'm gonna move... This as far as I can go. There we go. Yeah, there's all kinds of games that you could play. Um, I have so many. I have, like, way too many games. What are we doing here? Okay, we're going this way. That's good. We get... Oh, Spring of Life. Alright, and then you... Okay, no, that's it. Alright, that's all I can do. Is there any other things? Okay, we're just gotta... We gotta get this one caught up to where we are. So then we have a full army, which is still probably not strong enough. But we're gonna at least try. What is that? Tomb! Unexplored strong treasure site. Explore the ancient tomb for items. Oh. I just, I don't. Can we go to the shrine? Okay, we got the shrine. Very likely victory. Oh, you know what? This is gonna be easier than the goblin guy. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Now, okay. Battering Ram. High Elf Longbowman. Archers possess powerful ranged attacks. Uh, meaning they're still in threat in the zone. They can't shoot when they're close. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I can't even see anything. I was like, where's the enemies? <laughs> the other side. I just noticed that this is a unicorn and it's got like rainbow hair. Why is that not something I noticed until now? <laughs> Look at it! It's got like a gradient rainbow. Beautiful. I'm gonna go and hide this guy behind the battering ram. Yeah, we gotta we gotta get some revenge because that last battle was horrendous. Type of a regular unit. Okay. Just keep them together, maybe it'll be okay. You can move even closer. I want you to go there. Maybe we could cast a spell. What does Blessing do? Hmm, let's just see if- can we do poison? Oh no, okay. They have blight protection? Oh. I guess blind wouldn't be a bad thing. 
They're blinded. Oh, they resisted it. Oh no. Was that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't. Alright. Can we reach any of these? I guess we can just shield up, I guess. Since there's nothing else that can be that can be reached. Alright, that should work. Okay, okay. Now they're moving. Other bad guys are moving. Oh no, don't hurt my battery cam. Okay, it's alright, it's alright. Oh, oh. They're taking some damage. Oh geez. Whoa. Camera angle got all funky. Um, alright. Not bad, not bad. What about... Can I shoot acid darts? Oh, you know what? Oh, they already have... They have blight protection. If I do normal darts, how much damage? Shield range penalty? Mm, hold up. Let's see. Can I get a little bit closer and then hit these guys for a little bit more? They have a shield. But 6 to 8, explosive damage 3 to 5 that damage. Alright. Did that work? Is it working? Uh, eight, four, seven, three. Oh! They're almost dead! I would say that worked, eh? I don't care if they retaliate. They're dead! <laughs> In one hit, so... Easy. Uh, let's move you over here since uh, you can't move anywhere else. But what'd I do? Uh, let's just buff. Can we buff you? Oh, okay. We're just all buffing right now. Cannot reach. Wait, you're over here. Oh, you gotta move. Okay. I was so confused. I was, like, pushing the wrong thing. Okay, now what? You also want to shoot them? They have a shield. Oh, uh, can we move at all more? No. Okay. We're gonna hit... Not that one. We're gonna hit them with this. It's a Dino Unicorn. Yeah! <laughs> Something like that. Your leader just leveled up. When it level up, you get points to upgrade things and blah, 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 blah. All right, cool, 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 cool. Epic music! Oh my god, why does it keep moving my camera around? It's fine. Alright, let me move you here. Then shoot them. You're flanking. They have blessing. This is easy. We got them. Look at that. Look at that. They have a shield, but you know what? We're a battering ram. We'll be fine. Ah! Just like poked them. That was funny. And you can't do anything this turn. Alright, you... I guess we can just take this one out, hopefully. Or, yes! All right! I'm making progress. They have a shield. I think I'm just gonna beef up. Um, They will retaliate. So we're just gonna shield up. If they... Oh, they're gonna hit. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I was like, if I back up, are they gonna get hit? Yep. They did. Um... Okay, that's all I can do. I was like trying to figure out what exactly I am doing. 11 damage, oh no. I'm actually surprised this is going so good. This is really, really great. We can probably just kill them. <laughs> yup. They have a shield. Whatever, we're still gonna hit them. <laughs> um, we'll hit them with this guy. They do a lot of damage. Oh, come on. They're so close. Just, just take them out. Finish them off. Yeah, the leader got it. 
Easy. A familiar yet unknown voice dreams its way into your conscious. Granddaughter, I am proud of you. Tumultuous times are ahead, but you will do well. Listen to your heart, for things are not as they seem. Look for the good in unfamiliar faces. See the evil in familiar places. <laughs> my life ended because of treason from within our own ranks. Don't let that happen to you. Farewell, my child. Oh, are Elwyn's bones safe again? I hope the goblin's bite marks aren't too obvious to later scholars. We'll send Storm Sisters to close off and sanctify her tomb again. You are like your father, Sundren. Sardis has never shied away from doing what he needs to be done, no matter the cost. That kind of determination and strength is missing from Thanos, but you understand that one cannot always avoid the difficult decisions. Make sure the goblins cannot return. Root them out and defeat them all uh, once and for all. If we stop now, they will undoubtedly fester until they erupt again, not unlike the insidious weeds they crave to eat. Mercy has postponed suffering. Uh, you should grant them a merciful death now. Find Echo's capital and defeat him. Oh! Did I accidentally do the later part of the tutorial first? And so that's why I failed? Because now I need to go and kill the Goblin Echo? <laughs> of course. Of course I did that. So it's all good. Yeah, that was totally the way the tutorial was meant to be played. Yeah. <laughs> we got a bunch of loot. And now we have to upgrade the leader and do the things. But <laughs> with that done, I think, yeah, I did that backwards. But it was on the way. So I thought that it was what I needed to do next. Whoops. Yeah. But I think that's where we're going to stop here. <laughs> Didn't quite get through the tutorial and did it out of order. But we at least got through that part and I feel content. Maybe I'll do this again one day. I don't know. If you guys like this video, let me know. <laughs> I don't, I was struggling, but I feel like I'm, I'm, it's clicking a little bit more and more each time. Still was, I still was clicking the wrong button at half the time. It was like right click to move and I was left clicking. So it would like stop the selection and I'd not do anything. And it was just, ah, it's fine. So it looks like there's a lot of detail and depth in this. And it's like, I don't know, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool little game. It has pretty good reviews on Steam. So if you're interested in this type of game, it's, it looks like they might be working on a, uh, Age of Wonders. Is that what this game is called? It looks like Age of Wonders 4 might be in the works or if people want it to be in the works. But, uh, yeah, this game came out in 2014. It was a good time. Uh, <laughs> good luck editing. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is a, this is great. I, uh, I had fun. So we're going to now pick a letter of the alphabet. I guess I should do that via wheel. Hold on. No, 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 I didn't mean to click the wheel. Hold on. I should play it again. As of right now, I'm playing a different game every stream, but I will come back to certain games depending on how they go. So this could be one of those that I, I come back to. But we're starting a new thing where we're doing different games every stream right now. So it's like going to be kind of chaotic for a bit. Uh, wheelofnames.com. I need to put letter in the alphabets. Okay, so it did save that. All right. I'm going to do not A. It's going to be everything. C, D. Oh, boy. You want to watch me type this? E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, M, L, M, N, O, P. I know my ABCs. Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Okay. I think that's the alphabet. Let us spin and decide what we are going to get to play for next stream. Well, we don't know what we're going to play, but we're going to know what the game is going to start with. So let's roll for that. Give me, I don't, I have no preference. I don't know all these games at all. So, ooh, S. I like that letter. Oh, T. I mean, T is a good letter too. Just my name is a, has an S. Has a lot of S's in it, I feel like, so. But T's are cool. I have a T in my name. Okay, let's do T. 
for next time and let me just do a quick check on how many games we are gonna choose from i'm gonna double check them though because some of them are like dead games or multiplayer or something right uh okay we have tacoma we have a lot of t games not a lot no i lied i thought i had more than that uh tacoma never heard of it tempest three dead zed the tiny bang story Okay, Torchlight 2, good one. I played Torchlight 3? I, pl I thought I played Torchlight 2. No, I guess not. Tropco 4, Tropco 6. Another <laughs> management game. How much you bet we get? <laughs> it's just gonna be me learning to play strategy games. <laughs> no, we'll see. We'll see what we get. Um, but those are the game options. I might have a few more uh, from some Steam keys if I have them, if I can find them. Uh, but yeah, T is gonna be our letter for next stream. Uh, hopefully that's tomorrow. We'll do this again. I don't know what time, but hopefully tomorrow. Every day we're just gonna try get a little bit done and yeah, get through all these games. <laughs> I have too many games to play, so yeah. All right, I think that's about it for today. Thank you guys for hanging out. Join our Discord. Come hang out and uh, join all the YouTubes. I'm gonna be doing a lot more content. Also, this VOD will be turned into a YouTube um video so it'll be cut down and be like shorter <laughs> hopefully less than an hour instead of two hours so yeah uh people can watch that later if you missed it and you want to see more so yeah i'll be back uh, tomorrow thanks for hanging out and uh, until next time bye